Good morning, you guys. I just dropped the big girls off at school. Um, I'm coming home really quick so I can change. And then Adam's gonna take me, sorry. Adam's gonna take me to my LASIK appointment. Oh, I hear Tater. Hi, Chloe. Good morning. Hi, Tater Dot. <laughs> How did you sleep? How did you sleep? <laughs> did you sleep good? Oh. Good morning. Oh. Good morning. go get some food oh. yeah she loves these organic sunny days strawberry bars they're from earth's best grayson likes them too you want one should we open it okay let's open it open go some blueberries and some eggs Yummy. Where's your water? Found it. Oh. Your water. Good job. Let me get you some blueberries. Got a smush, 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 smush. Hey, 
go. You love blueberries, huh? Her and Grayson both love them. Dad's gonna make you some eggs, okay? I gotta get dressed. Okay? I love you. Here's my little cooking buddy. Do, do, do. Here's my little cookie buddy. Do, do, do. Who's my little cookie buddy? Do, 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 do. <laughs> Okay, Adam and I are on our way to my LASIK surgery. I'm freaking terrified. So nervous. I'm trying not to think about it. But just the thought of someone lasering my eyeball freaks me out. Adam's already had it done. So do you want to tell them how it was for you? They put you in this little uh, sling thing for your head so it can't move. And then they... Oh, that's gonna lift your you eyelids out. and tape them so your eyelashes <laughs> are probably gonna be screwed. <laughs> no, they told me to fill my lashes before and I did. Really? Like two days ago. Yeah. That's what they said? They said make sure you fill oh, your lashes I before bet. so that. Does it gives them something to grab onto? No, because I'm not gonna be able to get them filled after. For a while? I guess. I don't know. I, I, gotta I don't them. get fake lashes. I can't really. <sighs> so at my consult, they give you some of the numbing drops that they use during the procedure. So I kind of know what it's gonna feel like because my eyes were completely numb because they had to measure my cornea, I think, before the actual surgery, just to make sure my cornea was like healthy enough for LASIK. And so I have an idea of what it's gonna feel like, but they said that they use like way more of the numbing drops on the day of the actual surgery. So they gave me one at the console, but she says she uses like six to nine drops um, when you have your LASIK. So thankfully I'll be super numb, but right. just the idea of it kind of freaks me out. I know this has nothing to do with LASIK, but I freaking just got a big chunk of mint. He's really that into Daily Harvest just, smoothies right now. Um, but the actual procedure part is super fast. It's like under a minute for the laser part so I'm just trying to remind myself that it's really quick and I'm probably gonna be counting sheep the whole time <laughs> but I'm really hoping that you can come back in with me so you can like ease my nerves but I don't know if they're gonna let you yeah I don't know. But we'll vlog if we can and I'll have Adam vlog me after I'm not gonna be able to see anything obviously but I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna go home and take a nap I'm hoping I can fall asleep because if I can't, like, I'm not a type of person that can nap during the day, <laughs> so we'll see. Babe, I won't be able to see. I will show you things. You actually will see you just perfect. feel. No, no, you'll, uh, ooh, is that fancy little bigger? <laughs> no, but uh, you'll see when you, right when you're done. Uh -uh. When they, when you're done, they'll actually give you a, uh, I'm so nervous. They'll give you a test. You'll be able to oh, like really? look at you'll be able to see 2020 right out sir. What? It's weird, yeah. Because you go Will my here. eyes be like really sensitive though? Yeah, to light, of course. I mean they just got freaking zapped with the laser. Oh I'm so nervous. Hey, don't be nervous. Oh my gosh. I didn't ask me if there's tons of people in there. All right, everybody. Tara's gonna be coming out here in like two minutes. They won't let me in because of COVID. So I'm just gonna chill and they're gonna walk her out and uh, she's gonna see. She's probably gonna be like, I see too good or something. Cause that's what it felt like when I first got it. And like the halos and stuff. But yeah, I'm excited. They won't let me in there. Um, all they're allowing is patience, which kind of sucks. Cause I wanted to like, hold her hand or something but um, fortunately I couldn't do that but yeah she should, should be out here very shortly wow cool shades I said I have to wear these while I sleep too they're so cool that was really weird what they do babe it was a little longer than I thought I was like oh my gosh when is he gonna be done when is he gonna be done but the smell is really weird yeah it's burning flesh and so when you first, I don't know, you look at like a blinking green light the whole time and they move you back and forth. Do you remember that? From one machine to the other. 
Um, but it's, you're on the same table the whole time, but they just, they just like roll you. But let's, let's see them. <laughs> you can't see anything. Well, open them. Oh, they're red. Yeah, they're red. Can you see perfectly? It's like cloudy. Oh. They said it was going to be cloudy all day today, but not really what I expected it to be. But like better or worse? I don't know. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I've never had like any procedure done before, so that's it was very weird to have like a laser in your eye and he had like this tool and I was just thinking like gosh I can't believe I can't feel this right now because it was like a, a oh, scrapey tool yeah but you really don't feel anything like nothing at all they gave me Tylenol PM before I went back so that I can go home and sleep and um they gave me probably six numbing drops total in my eyes and the procedure was really quick but the smell was probably the worst part, but I think I did pretty good. He's like, you did really good. <laughs> I was just like so still. I was so scared I was gonna move while the laser was in my eye. But... Like sneeze. God, I didn't yeah. sneeze I was or like, something. I'm really worried that I'm gonna blink. He's like, oh no, don't worry about it. Your eye drops are gonna make it so that you don't have any urge to blink. I was like, okay. Right. I wish I would have brought a blanket or something because when, when we go in the sun, my eyes are gonna be really sensitive to the light. Someone told me to bring a blanket. Put or, like, two a sunglasses on here, put these over top. There we go. That's a that's a vibe right there. Is it a vibe? Oh yeah. <laughs> you Kim K. I cannot. I'm hungry. Okay, let's go. All right, babe. How you feeling? I think the numbing drops are starting to wear off because it's really starting to burn. Is it? Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. But naturally, we're like, hey, let's go to Panera Bread. I'm so hungry, but I couldn't even read the menu, so I just told Adam to. Get whatever you got. What did you get? I don't know. Right. <laughs> Chicken front dagger or something? It feels like when you cut onions, like it burns. That's yeah. what it feels like right now. It's a good feeling, huh? I can open my eyes a little bit, but not. And then it starts to get like really burny. Burny. <laughs> feel the burn. Oh, sorry. It does not feel good. can't really see right now, even if I, it feels like I need to drop, just need to read the, the package, because it feels like they're getting really dry. So immediately after treatment, your driver should take you home, keep your eyes closed, wear sunglasses, take a three or four hour nap. It is okay if you fall asleep, if you can't fall asleep, just relax and keep your eyes closed. But why? Once you wake up from your nap, start using the drops. Are you going to feed me? What do you want me to feed you? My sandwich. Here you go, Johnny Cash. Johnny Cash? Yeah, I think they always wear sunglasses. Mm -hmm. Z. Oh. Mm. Look at that thing. <laughs> I'm Good. not opening my eyes because it hurts. Good content right here. Eating sandwiches called a a bookie. What's it called? A bookie. A bu Where? Where you know you eat and talk. What's that thing called? Bakad. Mukbang. Mukbang. Oh my gosh, I was really wrong. Mm. I'm so sad with you with me. Okay, I just woke up from a pretty long nap. It's still light outside, but I have all the shades down because my light my eyes are still kind of sensitive so sorry it's kind of dark but um my eyes i noticed while i was sleeping were draining a lot like i had a lot of water just like pouring out of my eyes it's kind of stopped now that i'm awake i just put my antibiotic drops in so i'm gonna wait like five more minutes and then put the lubricating eye drops in um and then i Think they'll feel a little bit better there it just feels like i have like a lot of like crust around my eyeball right now because i was it was draining so much and i know i can't like rub my eyes or get them wet or anything and i just want to like go in the shower and like <laughs> wash my face to like get that all off but i'm like kind of scared to touch my eyes but yeah i can feel you know when you wake up in the morning you have like crusties that's how it feels but it feels like a lot right now because they were draining so much while I was napping. But they feel better, a lot better. On the drive here, I couldn't even, 
open my eyes. I had to have Adam take his jacket off so I could put that over my face because my eyes were so sensitive to the light. It felt like um, I was cutting onions whenever I opened my eyes, like really bad. So I'm glad my eyes feel normal now. I can't really tell if I can see any better because my vision was uh, nearsighted, so it was hard for me to see things far away. So I don't really have anything to like test right now because there's no like words or anything anywhere. But like I've been using my phone for the last couple of minutes and I can see everything pretty normal like I used to be able to see. So um, I can't really update you guys there. But yeah, that's the update for now. Adam just got home. So he's looking at my eyes. This one has like two little. Oh, don't touch it. Sorry, did I touch you? Almost. Two little little red dot things. This one. What do you think that is? Like blood vessels? Um, I don't know. But you see all the crusties like around my eye. I want to like. It's not really noticeable, honestly. I want to rub it off, but your I makeup can't. is like. Oh, that's not makeup. What is that? What? It's like it looks like makeup. You want that? <laughs> that maybe that's the crusties. Maybe it's like eye bruising okay. when I bruised a little bit. Try and test my eyes. I'm gonna have a. Sure, I already did this once, but I haven't done this line, so well, that's that's a hard word to say. Let's do this one. This word right here. I can't read that. I can't read that. Care or dry eyes. Yeah. Yeah, well, she read this line, but that's fine. Your hand so, was in the way. I'm sorry. Here. Well, you know what it says. I know, but let me see. Point it at me. Give me a different one. Do this line. The bold one. Oh, that's easy. Blink tears, preservative, free lubricating eye drops. Let me see if I can see it from that far. Do the top. The top bold line. I can't see it. Tears. Preservative free lubricating. Good job, babe. <clears throat> so she can see things like those small letters from here. And I guarantee you couldn't have done that. We should no. you know we should have done. We should have done a test. I know. Well they do it at the doctor. Too when late. They go back. <laughs> we can't like ask them, hey, can you like sew my eyes back together real quick? Because I can test it before. They have that all that information. Eye doctor. I go back on Monday. Okay, so it's Monday morning. I just got to my LASIK follow up appointment. I am going to update you guys on what my eye doctor says about how my vision is looking. I'm excited to see what my vision is now. When we were driving here, I was looking at the signs to see if it's blurry because I mentioned in the last couple clips that my far away vision was still pretty blurry when I was looking at things far away, but up close, it's still pretty clear and that's how it was before but I know it's um, pretty common to have your vision kind of blurred the first couple days so it has cleared up it's what is this day three babe yeah it's Friday Friday Fri yeah three days post LASIK surgery so I'm about to head in I have 10 more minutes until my appointment or pretty early my bruising is still pretty bad I don't know if I I think we showed this did we I think so yeah um I don't know if that's what it's called. Yeah, okay. I don't I don't know. We're just calling it bruising. <laughs> I don't know if that's really what's going on. Um, but this eye is really white and clear. So it's just my left eye that has a lot of those like red, I think they're blood vessels that burst. I don't know. But I'm sure my doctor will explain that. But I will update you guys once I get out of my appointment. Okay, I just got out of my appointment. My doctor said that I can see 2020 with both eyes available, but when I close my eye, like if I were to look at something like this with my eye closed I can see 2040 in each eye so she said over time since I had a really bad astigmatism my vision's gonna get clearer and clearer so I'm gonna come back in six weeks and check it again um but everything looks really good she said the redness is uh broken blood vessels from the surgery which is what we thought so everything's looking good um and I'm happy with like the results and how everything went. So 
hopefully this video was helpful if you're considering LASIK. We did uh, LASIK Plus here in Plano and we saw, um, or I saw, Adam booked it for me. His name was Robert Smith and he was great. So highly recommend him. I'll leave the information down in the description box if you guys are considering LASIK. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. Looking back on the things that we've taken for granted, but feels like we're learning to be better.